Today's game is coming to you live from Minneapolis, Craziana. We're at Mucus Asylum Stadium, and the inmates are taking their medication along with their seats, sharpening their knives, and hopefully not listening to the voices in their heads. Remember, in the NFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The Motor City Maniacs battle the Insane Colts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, man, the going to now. You know what have? Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Called the lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bull crap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. And it's first and ten. First down! He hit that line the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy Lohan's nose. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. The defender says it's fine. And now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And it's first and ten. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Oh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Second down and six. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third down and six. I just may be in commentary, but I thought you were supposed to throw the ball forward. Uh, yeah, 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 you're right. You should. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Boom! 
Bing dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. First down and seven. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Oh. Hey, no gain to that kill. Come on, get on the up, get on the up. Get on up. Get on up. Second down and seven. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's almost power to bring like a high cool. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot three. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. And four. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. First down! This guy just loved to hit. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, what the brutal hit! Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Hot, hot one, hot two. And he held on to that one for a first down. First down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, so he does have some turkey skin wrapped on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. Say what? Come on. 
Oh man, you can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? They want more points, so they're going for two. Runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Wow, those are just my balls. Hey, thanks for sharing, Bricks. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And hits the airport man oh and the late hit arrives right on time when it's your time to go it's your time and we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end finally and it's first and ten It's like when you shuffle your socks on a carpet. Oh, he was hitting mid-hurdle and fumbles the ball. And it's first and ten. And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. here on first and they've had enough the offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref first down and forever Getting killed by a chainsaw before he completed his bucket list on his bucket list. He can cross. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, hey, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. Second down and long. another pick man oh man the deep oh the unstoppable force meets the explodable object now hold on looks like now the offense is getting kills this is really a violent game guys he refused and he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down boom dead and down nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy ah uh, well he was a violent alcoholic a terrible father and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs <clears throat> really what counts at the end of the day, right? And it's first and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest tits? Well. <laughs> and it's first and ten. With the 
brain scrambler. Second down and five. was you can't kill the messenger because he's gonna kill you but then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him ah, i'm going in circles the offense is down to their last running back when he bites the dust they can only pass yeah well at least they don't have to forfeit them that's right but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers and it's first and ten hot, hot one Hot two, three. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And they run it for a couple of yards. Third down and ten. Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Nice punt. Should move him back nice. He's got the ball now. Let's see. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. Trick. This play is usually good for a quick score because no one can catch this guy. Look at him, he's like Speedy Gonzalez. Second down in a very long. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback, man, what a hit that was. Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot! That's why we love the MFL! And it's first and ten. Hot one! Always good for an easy kill. <laughs> First down in a mile. Hot one, hot two. I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this outcome. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, what a throw. That sonic blast just cleared the field for the receiver. First down. He was not going to drop that one. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! And it's first and ten. And that's 
it's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. Second down in a mile. They're stopping it for their own offense. They're hungry for the ball, partner. The ball? The pitchkin? Bacon! I'm hungry for bacon! That pass was way off target, but I'm pretty sure the QB will blame the receiver as he always does. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. You can tell he's pulled out a chainsaw now. <laughs> Shoe size, because he just walked. The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And it's first and ten. Perfect pass and the score! Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Eight. And he finds a boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo! All I need is 77 to bite it. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Ben? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. One, hot two, three. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least some. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy and he gets three points for it. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. It's a touchdown. Burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. He 
Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. for a first down to keep the drive alive. The offense is down to their last two linemen. Once they're gone, it's game over. Yeah, who cares? Linemen suck. They don't even deliver any fantasy points. They, they spend two years in the league and then they become bouncers at biker bars. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsanto Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second-half kickoff. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Not, not one. Not. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Second down and two. I don't know whose eyes the QV is using, but can we get him some new ones? He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And it's first and ten. to the races. And it's first and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. First down and seven. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown!
Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. The ball's turned over and the defense has it. He's rumbling toward the end zone to score a clusterfuck. Will he make it? Run, baby! Run! The 10. And that, ladies and mutants, is called a clusterfuck. It's a turnover on a two-point conversion. Return for a touchdown. Hey, man, nobody can touch you with an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good. Well, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabag after that hit. And it's first and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and two. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. <laughs> on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three returns. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. No doubt about dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The offense is down to their last surviving lineman. He's all alone out there, and when he dies, they'll have to forfeit. I know what it's like to be alone. I went to group therapy once to deal with loneliness, but no one else showing up. And it's first and ten. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Touchdown! And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done. I can't run like that unless it's Cooper. in his cheeks, though. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Still bet, Jarks. Yo, guys, suck. Yeah. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. 
They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. This is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. And it's first and ten. That's a six yard gain on that catch. Second down and four. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. First and ten. Nine, one, eight. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't always throw interceptions, but when I do, it's when the game is on the he's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. and two. Ah, another interception. He's a oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. That's a touchdown saving tackle right there. And it's first and ten. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division and weep tonight. And then Newton just about met his maker on that hit. I thought he was... Is that right, Glenn? That penalty makes no sense. And it's something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. You do it, Pussy defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to fight it. We're tied up at the end of the third quarter. You can smell the excitement on the fans. 
I mean, literally, it is ripe in here. Man. Dunya, was that you? Hey, throw me. warming up. impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Second down and a lot. Hot one, hot two, eight. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Third down and long. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And the defense gets another. Oh, man. Nick Vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. Don't worry, if he shot Devastating hit knocks the ball loose. He said he might catch him. Oh, you fat little mutant. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. He scores. He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Uh, don't call things epic, Rim. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. <laughs> don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't wrong. I might bet it was a chip wearing a wig. First and ten. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. The ten. It's a touchdown. is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And here 
here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked down? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. <laughs> Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. Six-yard game there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in dog turns on my front porch every day. Third and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just throw it to the guy in the same color jersey as you. You got it? Huh? Sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the next Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Briggs? Wonder what made him so mad. That yeah, was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but. You know, what the fuck are you talking about? I don't really know right now. What day is it? Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. It's the two-minute warning. You know what that means, right, Bricks? Yeah, take a giant whiz and get in a fight in the men's room. Second down and we've got to pick up at least half of this. That ball was almost intercepted. Third down in forever. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just gonna take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Unstoppable force meets the explodable object. He's at the 30, the 20, a touchdown saving tackle. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And 
And it's first and ten. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joe. And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Oh, and they got him. That's a touchdown saving tackle. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. You can't keep a good mule. That's a six-yard gain. The insane Colts do their sacred ritual blood dance after taking apart the opposition in a win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.